oh my god, finally I get to sit down with you and do a full glam look, just like I did a couple of months ago, and I'm super excited to start recording videos again and just getting into the makeup scene and doing my face and just giving you guys maybe inspiration or um i don't know some tips on how to blend or create like a perfect eye blend or eye makeup for anyone basically for any special eyelids or for any shaped eyelids or just anything in general now before we start i just want to say please subscribe to this channel if you enjoy my videos and also there's gonna be some um changes in the lighting because it's very um moody outside by the way happy fall i hope everyone is gonna have fun this fall and yeah so please like this video um subscribe comment on any ideas on what should i do today this is just gonna be eye makeup so for the rest of the video you're gonna be zoomed in on my eyes and you're just gonna see what's happening there how i'm gonna do my eyes and my brows like only this region of my face basically so i'm so sorry for this long ass intro let's just get into the video okay so you're zoomed in right now pretty much i know but let's just honestly get started so how i start my makeup is by starting with primer since i'm doing the eyes first because it's gonna be a heavy eye makeup look it's gonna there's gonna be a lot of fallout i'm gonna add this let me just i don't know this primer which this is by a off um you can't buy this anywhere it's only for oh, i don't know how to explain it honestly just buy a primer that works for you or a moisturizer this one works for me but you can't buy it anywhere So I applied the primer slash moisturizer and now I'm just gonna let it sit on my eyes. Um, I'm gonna let it sit, get dry. So I'm gonna start off with the brows. My brows are pretty thick, but they can be thicker and better and more symmetrical. So I'm just gonna do them with this brow pencil and how, I'm, and how I do my eyebrows. I think it's weird for some people. But that's just how I do them. So, by the way, you can see I'm bleeding here. Um, that is because um, I shaved my unibrow off. So, the eyebrow is done, as you can see, I'm gonna go, this is not, by the way, the finished, the finished brow, I'm gonna go in with some powder, translucent powder, to lighten it up, uh, set it, and I'm also gonna go in with some gel, brow gel to make the, um, my brow hairs more visible, and just to, for them to stick together and go in the right directions. So I'm going to do the other one off camera and I'm going to be right back. Okay, now that I have both eyebrows done, I'm going to continue with my eyelid. So the concealer that I'm going to use today is this Makeup Revolution London Conceal in the Fine one. I know Jeffree Star loves this one and so do I. It's really good. Um, honestly, the best and the cheapest for its price. Now I'm going to put this concealer on my eyelid. I'm going to blend it out. And as well, align and cut the eyebrow to perfection. So I'm gonna use this um, Makeup Revolution London Ghost Finish. I just bought it yesterday, so I don't know how it's gonna be. This is a new product for me, 
So let's just test it out and see how it does. Oh my god, I was not expecting this to be so thick. Oh my god. This is so thick. Well, um... I'm gonna leave this, um, to say... Why is this so... Oh my god. Okay, well, let's leave this to bake. And I'm gonna continue to the other eye. I look like a ghost. I'm gonna do my other eye off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, so I look, um... Disgusting right now. Looking at the viewfinder, I look really disgusting. Like, really. So, let's take this off and start with the eyeshadow. Because I cannot look at myself right now. Look, look at me on. Okay, let's see. Wow, I did a nice job at setting it, honestly. Like, I think that's... Wow, this powder maybe turned out to be not so bad after all. Okay, let's start with the eyeshadow finally i'm gonna take this kind of blending brush to do my um brow bone as in just give it some depth um by soft orangish color before we start with the browns now i'm gonna take this color pop and i'm gonna go in with the color magical which is this soft orange one first i'm starting off Outside my lids, I really want to focus it on the brow bone and the upper lid. Okay, I'm, oh my god, okay, I'm so close to you guys, but let's just continue with this eye look. I'm sorry, I just can't get over this. Okay, now that I blended out the a little transition color, I'm gonna go in with a soft brown. I'm gonna use this kind of brush. It's a little bit smaller. A little bit. This one is longer and fluffier. This one is longer and fluffier. But this one is a bit smaller, but it's fluffy as well. That's what sort of I want for the a little bit down from the transition I did. You're, you're gonna see. I'm gonna take this Makeup Revolution London palette and I'm gonna go with, oh, they don't have names. Well, anyways, I need a soft brown, so I'm gonna go in with this one, this color right here next to the white. I'm just gonna go from the outer corner and build one my way up and blend upward to that transition shade as I'm blending. I'm gonna go and take the other brush, the one we used, and just smooth everything out and blend it out. Next brush. It's this kind of brush. I don't know what brush this is, but it's smaller and it, it's gonna give me a nice, um, I guess grip or something to go even closer to the lid with a deeper brown. I'm gonna take a deeper brown from this ColourPop Sol palette. It's a very nice palette and it's very beautiful. You have nine shades and I'm gonna go in with and I'm gonna go in with this brown. So again, I'm gonna take that first brush that we used and I'm just gonna blend everything out even more so that it's gonna be very smooth and there's gonna be a nice transition. Okay, 
Now we're gonna go with a deeper brown. Yes, even deeper brown. ColourPop Dream SD Cathal Lights X Color ColourPop palette. And I'm gonna go in with the shade, this one, Elfish. And I'm gonna go even more into my outer crease. I'm taking a smaller brush like this one, just so I can get in there with it. And later on, I'm gonna blend it out. So let's, let me show you. Now that I slapped the color on, I'm gonna go in with that brush that was like for the brown. And I'm just gonna go in and blend it out upwards so it's smooth and it's seamless. Keep blending your eye and keep doing it because you really wanna work on it and blend it to perfection. Okay, so now that I added the deep brown, I'm gonna go in with the black and just put the black at the very inner corner here of my eye. Outer corner, outer inner corner. I don't know what is it, but I just need a black to give it dimension. So I'm taking the Morphe 35B palette because I feel like the 35B palette has the best um, black color, but then again, I feel like Morphe has the best black colors. It's located right here. I'm using this small, small, small brush to go really in there and put the black. Okay, so now that I blended this out with this brush, again, I'm gonna take this one and just go in and blend everything out. So now that we have the eye done and blended, I'm gonna go in with a shimmer color and I'm gonna cut the crease, but I'm not gonna use concealer. I'm just gonna use a shimmer color on a wet, um, on a wet flat brush, and I'll show you how to do it. Let me just blend this out a bit. I'm gonna add a little bit black here. So I'm not gonna use any more any more product. I'm just gonna use the leftover and bring this black a little bit. Oh wait, I almost forgot, so, sorry. Um, before we go in with the shimmer, I'm gonna take this off the salt palette. This color right here on this brush. And I'm just gonna go and blend out the these edges with it. Okay, so taking this flat brush that I wet, I'm gonna go in with the, again, Dream Ash, and I'm gonna go with this shimmer. gonna blend this here transition so that way both colors are gonna blend in so there you go the eyeshadow is complete let's continue to eyeliner and then lashes so for eyeliner I'm gonna use this NYX 
li uh, liquid liner and I'm just gonna put on a thick line and line this I don't know if you can see the liner, but this is our liner for today. Let's move on to the fun part, which is gonna be the lashes. So, I'm gonna be taking these cheap $6 lashes from, I bought these at NYX Makeup Revolution store. These are Double Up uh, Ardell Professional also this glue is as well Ardell and I bought it at NYX okay the eyelash has dried down now I'm gonna put it on my lid and how I'm gonna basically um place it very carefully is with this um, bobby pin. Let me just, like, I know it sounds weird, but let me just show you how I do it. And there we go. And I know you can see the white glue a little bit, but that's clear glue, which means that it's gonna dry down. And when it dries down, it's gonna become clear and you won't see the white. So I'm gonna go and beat my face. Like, I'm gonna do this eye, just like this one. I'm gonna go beat my whole face. And I'm gonna be right back to do my bottom, my bottom lid. And to show you what's gonna be happening there and also to finish off these eyebrows as well or I'm good I'm just gonna you know what I'm just gonna do I'm just gonna put the um, powder on them and then I'm gonna put the uh, gonna take off the powder and put brow gel that's basically what I'm gonna do for this brow okay after a fucking hour of doing this um, face um, what's left to do is to apply some mascara to do my bottom la uh, to do my bottom lid and to do my bottom lashes and I'm completely done with this. I spent way too much time doing my makeup than I should have. Um, so I'm taking this um, the Glossal Big Shot Volume Express Mascara by Maybelline New York. So this is the mascara. I'm gonna get a little mirror and let's just apply this. And I'm only applying this so that my real lashes can stick to the fake ones. That is the only reason why I'm gonna apply it. And I'm gonna apply it just on my real ones. I'm not gonna go all the way to the fake ones. So I'm gonna go in the Sol ColourPop palette in this color to blend it all on my bottom crease, on my, bo on my bottom um, eyelid, using this kind of brush. Next, I'm gonna go also in this brown one. And I'm finally gonna go in the ColourPop um, Dream SD palette brown shade, which is called Elfish. And I'm just gonna go on the outer, um, outer part of my um, corner on my bottom lid. And now to finish this off, I'm taking this. Essence All Eyes On Me Waterproof Mascara because it doesn't leave any um, chunks. It's, it's perfect to leave your uh, lashes. Very nice 
sm and smooth. So I'm just gonna apply it and that's it, basically. So that's the finished makeup look. If you liked this video and this um, very long makeup look, and if you learned something today at least, um, please leave a like down below and subscribe. Um, I'm gonna try to make a lot more videos like this because uh, I really love doing them, but sometimes it can be um, pretty overwhelming. But anyways, follow my social medias down below as well. And that's basically it. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.